Hey there, this is Jeremy from VideoFort with another tutorial. This time we're going to learn how to use Adobe Color within After Effects. And it's actually really easy. So first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Window menu, drop that down, open up Extensions, and open the Adobe Color themes. So what this is going to do is sync up uh, this window with your Creative Profile. And you'll see you have three menus here, Create, Explore, and My Themes. So if you click on My Themes, it's going to open up all the themes that you've created either through the website, through a desktop app, or through a mobile application. So you can see the four here that I've created before. You also have the Explore tab, and what that shows is all the themes that have been created by Adobe Color users. So you have this drop-down menu uh, that gives you a couple different options. You have All Themes. And that'll bring up you know different options than if you go to most popular, most used, or random. And then you'll also see that you have this search bar. So say I wanted to look up sunset. I'd type that in, search it. So the results I would get would be all the color themes that have the word sunset. So let's take a look at a couple of those. Let's say I really liked Midwest sunset. You see that there's the actions tab here and what I can do is click on that and then I can add this to my favorites. Then if I go over to my themes, drop down to my favorites, you'll see that Midwest Sunset has been added. So let's finish off by creating a color theme. Let's go ahead and click on the Create tab, and you'll see our color tool here. So dropping down this menu, you'll see that you have various options for creating these themes, whether it's monochromatic, triad, shades, or analogous. And if you want to create a theme, you can go ahead and just start dragging these color pickers around, and then you'll get your options down here. And you can click on a color, change where it shows up, change the value below it, and that'll give you different results as well. So you can really customize these into a theme for exactly what you're looking for. Then once you're happy, just drop down, go ahead and name that. Save it, and it'll be in your My Themes menu. So what's really great about this extension is that when you have this window up, you can use any tool that uses a color picker to come in and select colors directly from your theme. And after you create your color themes, they'll be available for other users that are on either the desktop app, the mobile app, or the website. So that's pretty much it when it comes to using Adobe Color Themes inside of After Effects. Be sure to check out videofort.com for more After Effects and Adobe Premiere tutorials.